Hey guys, what's up? It's me, Destiny, and this is my third time trying to film a video today. I don't know what's going on. I have a fail tutorial for this eye. I'm just going to tell you what I have on my eye really quick because it's a really pretty look and I was really, really pleased with the results and of course it didn't work out for me. So I have on my Sephora Statue Bronze. If you don't know what I'm talking about, I will have a link in the bottom bar to a video where I explain what this is and how much I love it and I just love it. It's basically just a cream eyeshadow liner. And then I have on the MAC Burning, I mean Illusionary Burning Ambition Duo. I have the bright color in my inner area and then the brown color and on the outside of my eye I have deep purple which I actually believe is a MAC pigment pigment I got this as a sample and um, just a little bit of black eyeliner and some mascara and then what this video is actually really about is my favorite new foundation and I mean it's pretty much a rendition of my old fin favorite foundation one of my favorite foundations and this is my do it myself homemade tinted moisturizer and this basically consists of two makeup forever colors 85 and an unknown color which I think is 75 I will have the actual colors in the bottom bar they both finish matte and then I have a matte finish um, moisturizer from La Roche Posay actually it's from Vichy and it's Norma Dorn Pro Matte and it finishes matte it has SPF it's a green moisturizer for acne prone oily skin and then I put a little bit of primer in here also I believe I used some Laura Mercier oil free primer in here to give it a nice slip to give it a nice blend I put the kitchen sink in this foundation and I absolutely love it this is the first foundation that I've used that no holds bar I do not have to set I do not have to set this foundation and that is really really convenient especially when you're out and you don't have a whole bunch of things with you all you have is your foundation and maybe a tool your hands or something like that so this is really really good I've been loving this I actually like I said I adjusted the color from my original video which I only used 85 I actually added a little bit more of a yellow tones uh, makeup forever foundation Vel matte velvet still and um, I think those are the only adjustments I've made I've been wearing this in every video ever since that video so if you're looking and you're like what foundation do I have on it is this bad boy right here I absolutely love it it's matte oil free SPF 15 customized by me and I absolutely love it. I just wanted to come and do a really quick um, update on that because I've had a couple of questions in my past couple of videos about what foundation I've been wearing. And it's that one. And I'm absolutely enjoying it. I don't have to do many touch-ups at all. Like maybe during midday in my T-zone I might get a light shine. But it's nowhere near compared uh, to any other foundation that I might have used um, outside of a really good one such as Makeup Forever HD Matte Velvet Face and Body you know I'm a Makeup Forever junkie if you're watching out there I love you guys but um yeah so that's pretty much it for my homemade tinted moisturizer review update I will have another tutorial on the new color and how it looks when I'm applying it to my face and that will be it for this uh, video guys I will do a redo on this makeup look if you want to see a tutorial on this then definitely let me know down in the comments below as always guys thank you so much for your support it means the world to me I'll be in touch and hopefully you'll do the same bye